Hello, I'm Dr. Spencer Payne, and today I will be talking a little bit about sinus headaches. After finishing my ear, nose, and throat training, I completed a fellowship in nasal and sinus disorders. As a result, I see patients suffering from facial pressure, sinus congestion, and headaches nearly every day of my life. What you may not know is that the majority of what people and many doctors call sinus headaches are probably not related to the sinuses at all. Because the lining of the brain and the inside of the face and the nose share the same nerves, it can be very hard to determine exactly where the pain or pressure sensation is coming from. Migraine headaches, cluster headaches, and tension headaches frequently cause throbbing pain in or around the sinus area. Some of these and a host of other facial pain syndromes can also cause a runny nose, nasal congestion, tearing, and bloodshot eyes, so it is no surprise that they are often confused for sinus issues or infections. If the mucus you experience with a sinus headache is not cloudy or discolored, there's a much better chance that you're having a migraine or other headache instead of an infection. In this case, antibiotics would not be a good idea. Also, many times the medications you might take for a sinus headache, like painkillers or decongestants, can make the problem worse over time, especially if you take them frequently. I invite you to explore enthealth.org and navigate or click on Find an ENT so you can get in touch with an otolaryngologist like me who can help you figure out how to get the care that you need. Thank you.